let us do problem number one so here we have to find the value of a32 multiplied by capital A32 we know that the capital AIJ is the cofactor of the element AIJ so the cofactor capital AIJ of an element is given by the formula minus 1 power i plus j multiplied by capital M of ij where capital M is nothing but the minor of ij therefore a of 3 2 is equal to minus 1 power i plus j here i is 3 j is 2 so we get minus 1 power 3 plus 2 multiplied by minor of ij that is minor of m 3 2 that is equal to minus 1 power 5 and minor of an element minor of 3 2 is nothing but you remove the second column and third row or m 3 2 is third row and second column so we get the minor happens to be 2 5 6 4 that is the minor so the minor of minor m 3 2 is nothing but the determinant of 2 5 6 4 that is equal to so the value happens to be that is equal to minus 1 determinant value is 8 minus 30 that is minus 22 then the value of cofactor a 3 2 is equal to 22 so we have found the value of a 3 2 and obviously the small a 3 2 is nothing but the element third row and second column third row and second column means this is third row and this is second column the element is 5 so a 3 2 is 5 and the cofactor a of 3 2 we have found the value to be 22 so when you multiply these two you get 110 that is the value of the product now let us look at problem number 2 given family of curve y equal to mx we have to write the differential equation let us write the given equation as y equal to mx and we have only one arbitrary constant here which is m so we to get the differential equation and there is only one arbitrary constant we have to differentiate the function with respect to x only once therefore differentiate y with respect to x we get dy by dx is equal to m and here we have to eliminate the uh, arbitrary constant m from this equation y equal to mx m is equal to y by x and substitute this value of m in the differential equation we get therefore we get dy by dx is equal to instead of m now substitute the value y by x that is equal to y by x that implies y is equal to x into dy by dx that is the differential equation representing the family of curve y equal to mx now let us look at problem number 3 now the total revenue the total revenue is given as a function of x so let us write that the revenue is a function of x where x is the unit sold equal to 3x square plus 36x plus 5 that is a given function now they have also given the marginal revenue is nothing but rate of change of total revenue therefore to get the marginal revenue we have to differentiate 
the total revenue function with respect to x. Obviously, rate of change of revenue means it is a first order derivative. So, marginal revenue is equal to differentiate r of x with respect to x, that is d r of x by dx, that is equal to 6x plus 36. Now, we have to find the marginal revenue when x equal to 5. So, in this derivative at x equal to 5 we get 6 times 5 plus 36 that is equal to 66 is the correct answer for the given problem.